Hey folks, Van Camp and Woody here with my little buddy Nebo. Welcome to my next video. Oh, gonna catch y'all up with what's going on here. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, hit that subscribe button, the bell notification, let you know when I upload a new video. Hey, I appreciate each and every one of y'all. Welcome to your new uh, subscribers. Glad to have y'all here. So bear with us and we'll catch y'all on the other side. Here we are at Fort Laramie, Wyoming. Here at the city park here. Uh, off of Laramie Street, I think it is. I'll put, I'll tell y'all in the description. But um, this would just come to after checking out in a you know, small town, which y'all seen the pictures of. You know, just, it's just a small city park. They allow overnight uh, stays, you know, so, you know, get up and get, do what you got to do. Like I am this morning, it's the next morning, you know, uh, city camps, I'm starting to lean toward them, you know, uh, especially when I'm in route to places, I know, still don't, I don't have to get on the interstate. So, this is it, Fort Laramie City Park, catch you on the other side. Hey folks, welcome back to this side of the video. And like I said, it is the next morning here, Fort Laramie, uh, Wyoming. Uh, the reason I've been moving around so much this uh, this uh, year, uh, spring has been pretty awful with severe weather down in my normal, where I normally camp at in the Panhandle of Texas and Oklahoma. And, uh, you know, it followed us up through the plains and I... Um, you know, and then the temperatures are still cool. Uh, here it is, mid-June, and the temperatures are dropping down in the 30s, low 40s. And uh, so I'm going to be content wherever I'm at. That's why I move like I do, you know. So I well, need a haircut, don't I? But anyways, <laughs> um, I'm going to be content where I'm at. So, you know, I'm kind of like doing a tour, I guess you would say, because I've covered so much. Uh in the last two months, you know, and uh, that's just how I do things, you know. I, I, I'm not your, I'm not your typical nomad. Uh, you know, I, uh, I'm not your big YouTuber. I'm, in, you know, I guess what they call the bottom of YouTube, and I'm fine with that because I'm not monetized. I don't want to be monetized. You know, um, 
I um, try to keep this where I uh, help folks out that are low income like myself and on disability and uh, retirement like myself. You know, um, you, there's more than just sitting at home or in a, what uh, they officially call the tomb where you just waste away. You know, I'm going to waste away. I'm going to waste away out here on the highway. Uh, that's what I did for 30 year career before I uh, got picked up by that tornado. But, you know, it's, uh, uh, and it's still kind of, you know, it, um, affects me on how, on how I do my camping, you know, and, uh, I, um, hopefully sometime in the near future, I'll get the money back in my account that I needed, uh, to start all over again with the, uh, bigger van or whatever I'm going to go with, you know, uh, I just got to figure out what I'm going to do once and for all, but, um, City camps, they are uh, part of my uh, of my uh, options. You know, so uh, you know, if you're going into a town somewhere and you're tired, just look up and see if the, you know look on Google like I did this one here, City Park, Fort Laramie uh, City Park, took me right to it, uh, and. Um, you know, and then I did look at the reviews. It talked about over, you know, they, uh, uh, town is accommodating. They allow you overnight stays. And, uh, you know, so think about that. Uh, you know, just try, try to make it as easy as possible so you, you don't stress well, where am I going to sleep, where I'm going to sleep. Uh, I've done an awful lot of Walmart parking lots this, uh, 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 the past couple of months, and I'm, I'm about done with that with the noise and the uh, uh, inconsiderate, people that aren't living the lifestyle like we are uh, we seem to be a more uh, compassionate and a more understanding and more uh, reasonable but, uh, last night there in Cody some wahoo in a big old travel trailer had had his side outs on both sides and uh, decided at 10 o'clock he's going to crank up his generator 10 o'clock at night you know and uh you know, uh, if you was in an RV park, they wouldn't allow that. The quiet time, you know, from 10 p.m. to 7 a.m. I think it is, yeah, 7 a.m. You know, so, you know, have some respect for uh, people. If you're watching my channel and you are one of those folks, have some respect, man. Go and get out to yourself if you go. If you need the creature's comforts at home, why are you even camping anyways? Go on about your business and, you know, uh, uh, you know, have some respect for other people, you know. Uh, sitting there running with a generator all night long, just so you can have the creature's comforts of being at home, because you're glamping, you're not camping. So that's all I got to say about that. It, it, it is starting to get on my, you know, my nerves a little bit because I've been doing it seven years, and it just just this past year, I just I've noticed it because I've been around people more now than what I have been. So, but uh, I'm gonna wrap it up here. I'm just rambling. Hey, I do appreciate each and one of y'all who has subscribed to my channel. Welcome all y'all to the, to your new subscribers. Um, just here trying to help. I'm not trying to be no superstar or anything. Just who I am. So for now, y'all stay safe. Stay healthy. Keep smiling. Treat one another like you will be treated yourself. We'll catch y'all on the other side.